In this short video, we're going to talk a little bit about an electronic device that's found on some gas furnaces. And even though it's not covered in this section, it is also found on some oil furnaces. This is called a fan center. Now, the reason we use a fan center is because in many cases, the original furnace wiring was not set up to add air conditioning. Okay, the um, furnace oil or gas will start the fan with a thermal type fan switch like the combo fan limit switch we talked about in a prior video. Okay, and it starts it in heating mode. But the problem is in air conditioning, if we started, if we didn't have a fan limit switch or, or fan center, we would never be able to start that fan motor running for air conditioning because the temperature doesn't go up, it goes down. So when there is no separate relay, a fan relay must be added when the air conditioning is installed. The relay is so sometimes furnished in a package with the control transformer called a transformer relay package or a fan center. The fan relay is controlled by the G terminal on the thermostat. Now, there's a little note of caution here. The fan center is part of the low voltage and high voltage circuits. You have to make sure you use proper caution whenever you work with them. High voltage is not very forgiving, and low voltage will blow out a transformer if you wire it incorrectly. So this is the example of a fan center. It consists of a relay, a transformer, and a low voltage terminal board. And if you look at this, you'll see the relay is on the bottom. It's a Mars relay. Then you have a transformer and a terminal board. Now the terminal board always has two wires that is pre-wired on it. You have a C and you have a wire coming off the G. Okay, that is actually to the coil of the relay. The C terminal here ties in directly to the common on the transformer and the R terminal ties in directly on the common of the transformer. Okay, so all you really need to do is put the wires in the right place. 120 volts is applied to the primary of the transformer. Okay, those wires are usually hanging off here on the back. This is designed to mount on a square to, on a square wiring box. The thermostat wires are wired directly to the terminal board on the transformer. The terminal C and G is used to power up the coil on the relay. Your wires from your fan connect to the terminals on the relay, whether they're normally open or normally closed. So here's the wiring diagram, okay? So you're gonna bring your line voltage, and let me go ahead and I'm gonna draw this in, okay? You're gonna bring your line voltage into here. And since this is labeled 120, okay, this would be L and that would be N. Okay, that's wires behind the package. Then over here, you're gonna come out of R to R on your thermostat. You're going to come out of G to G on your thermostat. W is a, just a junction point, but again, you're going to bring it to that, and W will go to whatever, to a gas valve or something in your furnace. Let's just say it goes to the gas valve. Okay, Y is again a junction point. Okay, so your Y wire will come from your thermostat with your Y, and then it will also go outside to your compre compressor condenser contactor. C will go outside to your co contactor in the condenser. And if you need, if your thermostat has a C terminal, it will also come there, okay? So it's a matter of just putting the wires in the right place on the low voltage and line side. Now, on the, um, on to turn your fan on, okay, becomes a little bit more interesting. Let me change the color here, okay. On the fan side, you're gonna also come from line and you're gonna go to the black, okay. The red goes to the cooling speed on the fan. So on your fan motor, this would probably go to high because our cooling speed is high. The brown wire, which is the normally closed, goes to my combo fan limit switch. Okay, 
or whatever controls the fan on the heating side. Okay? So that's how you wire it. It's just very important to get the wires in the right places. Always look at the wiring diagram before you wire one of these. Okay, and this is just another way of showing what I just drew out. Okay, in a basic circuit, you're going to connect all the ter thermostat terminals to the right place. Okay, um, and this is a pictorial. The relay in the fan center is the same as a Mars standalone relay. If that relay goes bad, just pop it out and replace it with a standard Mars relay. The Y and the W and the Y terminals are dummy terminals that are just there to facilitate wiring. It's a lot neater to put your um, screw to put your wire junctions under a screw than a whole bunch of wire nuts around the place. Okay, so again, when you come back to your fan limit switch, okay, the Y and the W terminals. They really don't do anything other than give you a place to put your wire connections. Okay. R, C, G all have functions behind it. Okay. So all your low voltage wiring is here at the top. All your line voltage wiring is at the back because you have to put line voltage inside a, inside a junction box.